As we head into Halloween season, we wanted to re-air a segment that our own Maureen Boyle did just a few years back that was full of great pumpkin decorating tips. Maureen was married this past month, and our own Maureen Bates is now Maureen Boyle. Congratulations, Maureen. Halloween is a great time of year to have a little good-spirited spooky fun, telling ghost stories by candlelight, admiring the colorful fall foliage. Pumpkins also seem to be everywhere this time of year. So here are a few and safe car-free pumpkin crafts you can do at home to get you in the spirit. You're going to need a few supplies, some lace, thumbtacks, school glue, a paintbrush, a plastic knife, a pair of wire cutters, a drill, scissors, tissue paper, and of course, pumpkins. The first project is a lace and stud pumpkin. You will need lace, tacks, scissors, and a little patience. The first step is to take your lace and tack it to the bottom of the pumpkin next to the stem base. Trim any extra lace and don't crowd the tacks too much on the bottom. After you've attained your desired pattern, tack a nice bow on top if your pumpkin is lacking a stem. Create the crosshatch, carefully tack the lace in an even horizontal fashion around the pumpkin. Once all your tacks are in place, you'll have a beautiful finished product with a little edge. The next project is a paper mache pumpkin. This one is a little messy. You'll need tissue paper, glue, water, a paintbrush, and a plastic knife. The first step is to create your glue water mix. It's a little less glue than there is water. Be sure to fully mix the adhesive. Then brush on some of the glue water mix and begin to apply your tissue paper. Be sure to brush over the top to create a nice smooth surface. Let the wet paper dry for several hours before adding any elaborations. The final project is floral pumpkins. You will need silk or real flowers, a drill, wire cutters, and a piece of lace. The first step is to use your wire cutters to trim off some desired silk flowers. No need for the wire cutters if you're using real flowers. Next, you want to carefully drill holes in your pumpkin. Be careful not to drill through the pumpkin. Continue on to create a floral pattern that suits your tastes. Add some finishing touches with some lace, and you'll have a beautiful fall centerpiece. Those are three easy and safe pumpkin crafts you can do at home. Tweet us your pumpkin creations at PCN Director or on Facebook at PAC TV Community News. I'm Maureen Bates with your Arts and Entertainment Report, PAC-TV Community News.